The movie explains how to draw 3D reinforcement and obtain 2D technical drawings in all plan. In this example, I will show how to do this into 3 simple steps. Creation of the model, preparation of the associative views, and adding reinforcement to the model. We will do every step on the separate drawing file. As the initial step, we will prepare a model of the structural element and will change some parameters to obtain better view. Secondly, we will prepare the associative views that will be needed, the top view and the elevation. And finally, we will add the reinforcement with the help of the function FF components in a few clicks. Additionally, I will show how to modify parameters in a very intuitive way. Here is the task. As an example, we will consider the column. You see the part of the computation for the transverse reinforcement done in accordance with Eurocode. All needed parameters you see on the screen. The column with the dimensions 35 and 50 cm and the height 3 meters should be reinforced with the principal reinforcement, steel bars with assumed diameter 20 mm and assumed diameter for the stirrups is 8 mm. There will be three regions in terms of the transverse reinforcement spacing, the top and bottom regions with spacing of 21 cm and 35 cm as spacing for the middle region of the call. Let's continue in all plan. I have copied the last slide of my presentation here. Let's open on a project-specific basis and create the new drawing file model. To create a model of a column, open the palette tools, model architecture, second tab, and select the column. Let's check the physical parameters and compare them with the task. The width, thickness and the height, all that is needed for this example. To put it, simply click in any place. Let's check in the several views, all plus two, Right-click in the animation view to assign surfaces, select already predefined transparent concrete, and click OK. We may also add the edges for this animation view. Simply activate edges. 3D model of a column has been created. Now we can start with the second step and create the views. Activate the second drawing file. We may assign it as a views. Open the palette tools, engineering views, details. In the first tab, the first icon, create view. To create a view, simply click on the model. And to, to prepare plan view, stay in the circle. Uh, automatically, we may sign it. Similarly with the elevation view, but this time we have to click outside the circle to make an elevation from a needed side. Now we can locate the elevation and again all plan offers to sign it automatically. Additionally, we may do 3D view or isometric view for our technical drawings. Uh, for this we can use another viewport. Simply copy the view from the isometric view to your plan view. Again we may sign it. So we have prepared three views. It's enough. And now we can continue with the next step. We can open on the project specific basis to prepare the 3D reinforcement. So let's prepare the third drawing file reinforcement. The most automatic way how to do that, perhaps the function FF components from engineering model. So tools, engineering. The first tab and FF components. So let's select the first type. Uh, now we have the possibility to compare the initial task with the data that we have to provide, we may check the bottom upper upper bottom region for the transfer reinforcement, diameters for the di stirrups and for the longitudinal reinforcement, clear cover, and okay. 
Mm, so all we have is to locate the pointer and click inside the plan view. 3D reinforcement is created. Let's check in the animation view. We may also make changes for the reinforcement. For instance, we may, uh, in the representation of reinforcement, we may change the surface colors depending on the diameters. Alplan offers very easy functions how to prepare 2D technical drawings. For instance, we may add partial schema for the principal reinforcement or for the stirrups by one click. Also, we can we can prepare the reinforcement legend. It's possible to select some types or modify them or prepare your own bar schedule. It's possible to prepare it also in one click, as you see. Moreover, everything apart from reports work in all plan as associative, means connected, and any changes will be provided for all the views, reports, legends, and so on. Here I would like to show how it's easy to modify some parameters in all plan. Simply select several stirrups, and we can change the diameter or stirrups, uh, or stirrup spacing, otherwise it's possible to change the number of stirrups for this selected region. I want to highlight that all of the changes we are doing directly on the graphical representation on the model. As you see, other views also change, including reinforcement legend. That's all, my name is Konstantin, Beam Platform.